Hello friends, I'm Perwes and this is our 14th video in Qt5 C++ GUI application development. In the previous video, we have learned how you can create uh, menu items and also toolbar, also uh, how you can add actions uh, for your Qt5 application. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can create a uh, print uh, dialog in Qt5. Uh, so, I'm using my previous uh, application and I'm going to just uh, in here I want to add a print uh, menu item like this and now you can see in here I need to just an icon and I'm going to just uh, for example I want to just check my displaced icon because I, right now I don't have any print icon okay click on okay uh, now I have my print in here uh, before this uh, for creating a, a print dialog first of all you need to add the print support to your uh, dot profile open your dot profile and in here I uh, just copy this and paste it in here and just change this to uh, print support print support like this okay now close your this and save all now it's going to build successfully okay now the build is completed and now i'm going to open my main window.h and before this uh, i'm going to just uh, click on this and make go to slot uh, triggers okay now this is my where my uh, print dialog code will be I, I will write in here uh, before this open your main window.h and you need to add in here uh, q uh, printer also i need to add a q print dialog like this okay now open your main window.cpp uh, the first thing I need you need to create a printer object. I'm going to create a Q printer I call it printer like this and now uh, after this I need to create a Q print dialog a Q print dialog. I'm going to name it dialog like this and now it needs uh, it needs uh, two parameters. The first one is uh, uh, you need to give a uh, reference to the to your printer uh, like this uh, printer and the second one is the parent it's this okay now I'm going to create uh, uh, also you need to add for example uh, I'm going to add a text edit in here uh, like this because when you're going to print something uh, you need to add text edit you write in here and you print okay uh, let me ch uh, choose this and make it a uh, layout vertically okay uh, now I'm going to open my this uh, my main window.cpp again now in here I'm going to create a F uh, condition F uh, I'm going to check the condition F UI uh, text edit Mm, if you want a uh, text edit uh, text uh, cursor has selection dot has selection and uh, let me in here uh, I need to create a, uh, it's not important but you can do I am going to create a dialog dot set window uh, title uh, print a document print document okay now if this is the case um, I'm going to check my dialog dot add enabled option add enabled option and I want to add a Q abstract print dialog for the prints print selection Q abstract Q abstract print dialog 
print selection. You can see it have uh, it has previous focus chain printer uh, print selection. Okay, uh, and now I'm going to create another one for executing my uh, uh, dialog. If uh, dialog dot execute is not equal to Q dialog accepted. Q dialog accepted. If this is the case, I'm going to just return. Okay, this is the complete code. Uh, let me run this. Hopefully, we don't get any error. Okay, now it's building and running. Uh, maybe there will be error. Uh, yeah, you can see. Cannot open. Let me build a uh, run QMAC and build rebuild all. This will solve solve the problem. Uh, I think now it's rebuilding and rebuilding the project. I'm waiting for completing. Now it. Take, yeah, now it's completed successfully. Uh, run your application. Okay, now I have uh, my uh, application, and if I write something and if I uh, click on edit, in here I have a print. You can see now I have a nice print dialog. Uh, thank you guys. If you have any question, please let me know. And for the further videos, please subscribe to my channel.